Now from hurricanes to volcanoes, lava is flowing in Iceland after yet another volcanic eruption, the seventh to happen this year. As News 15's Evan Brown shows us, it's forcing evacuations after leaving some communities in the dark. For the seventh time in just one year, southwest Iceland sees a major volcanic eruption. It started late Wednesday night when earthquakes caused a nearly two-mile-long fissure to open up in the same volcanic system that forced the evacuation of Grindavik last December. Huge plumes of lava were seen shooting into the air and flowing towards the popular Blue Lagoon geothermal spa. Dozens of nearby homes were evacuated as the lava flow melted roads and power lines. The electricity supply has uh, been uh, destroyed because of the, the heat from the lava has simply melted or affected the, the, the lines. And now there's no electricity in Grindavik. Local authorities declared a state of emergency and sent teams to assess the damage. Scientists say this eruption appears to be less intense than previous ones. Still, it happened with little warning. We've seen a longer period of in slight increase in background seismicity. So over a few weeks, we haven't really had that this time. It's been very low seismicity. Grindavik has largely remained a ghost town since January after lava damaged infrastructure and homes. Barriers were constructed to protect the town, but many residents still relocated. And some say they're not sure if they'll ever return. Volcano experts say despite the smoke and lava, there should be no disruption to air travel. Eben Brown, News 15.